We had not seen buffalo for many days. If they are anywhere near, my father would find them. He is one of the best in our village at finding the trail of the buffalo. He is called Strongbow. The other man is called Big Horse, my father's friend. I am called Weakaluta. It means red feather. I've lived for 12 winters, and usually boys my age don't get to ride with their fathers. But my father says I'll soon be ready for the hunt myself, and I must learn the ways of the buffalo. For the buffalo is all important. Without it, we would not be able to live the way we do. Our very homes are made from the buffalo. Our teepees have been sewn together from buffalo hides. A teepee makes a very nice home, and it is very quick to set up, which is a good thing because we're never in one place for long. My mother, Sound of the Wind, always sets up our teepee. She does so with help of another woman in the village. First, three lodge poles are set up to make the basic shape of the teepee. Thinner poles are placed between the three main poles. All the poles are then bound together. Shunka, our dog, enjoys watching the work. Buffalo hides are then draped over the poles. This is hard work because buffalo hides are very heavy and a total of 18 hides are used to cover one teepee. The hides are then stretched tight and pegged around the outside edge. The hammer my mother is using is made from an elk antler. While my mother puts up the real teepee, my little sister, runs like a rabbit, practices printing one up herself. This is how we learn things, by copying our parents. After the teepee is up, my mother will clear a place inside for our fire. She is using her buffalo horn to scrape away the grass. The fire will keep our teepee warm on the coldest of nights, and it can also be used for cooking. Before the fire is lit, flaps at the top of the teepee are open to let out smoke. Next, my mother places buffalo robes on the ground to make a nice soft floor. She sets up backrest. These are made out of sticks and lays out a couple of pillows, which are filled with soft buffalo hair. A teepee can be a very comfortable place. One of the last things my mother does is to hang our wind chime. It is made from buffalo hooves and makes pretty sounds when the wind blows against the teepee.